Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming with another episode of Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic 2, The Sith Lords. Alrighty, when we left off, we had just fought our way through bunches and bunches of Zerka mercenaries to make our way to an old military base which had a one AA tower, uh, two had a landing pad but no shuttle and apparently the shuttle is inside the old military base which we are in front of the entrance to now uh th i think we have a third thing or fourth thing i lost count <laughs> be honest, of the things i was counting uh listen there, there's there's a, there's a thing going on inside the base apparently the zerka exploration teams woke something up and now people inside the base have been dying, but it hasn't come out of the base. So, whatever it is, isn't too bad, but it's bad. We're going to have to fight our way through that. So we're going to have to head in and deal with that. Um, also, while I was trying to record earlier, uh, there was a bit of a bug um, with the way characters were holding weapons we're going to hope that it's no longer uh applying that uh and if it does oh well it's just a graphical glitch we'll have to deal with because it's not all the time but it is weird and annoying but anyway in we go and force fields because of course but I remember Baudur, if I remember hitting the right button, has a arm built just for this. This arm of mine isn't just for show, General. Stand back. I don't know why it had to do the cutscene when the I already switched to him. were a little surprised when I broke my way out of my holding cell. The shields there were even weaker than these, after you. Hmm. He didn't move his mouth with that, but okay. Baudur has the ability to break through various shields with his repulsor fist. Yep, that was a thing I already knew. Because I remembered that little tidbit. Also, we we're going to have to avoid these grates, because they put out poison. Oh boy, I have no idea what that hitching was, but that was weird. Hey, that was beautiful. That worked. Let's dealt with the other one. Okay. And I deal with you. It won't let me target you. That's weird. At least let me deal with the other one. There we go. Beautiful. And there we go. Perfect. That was beautiful. All right. Um, slice into the terminal just to download the facility map. And we've already destroyed the local turret, so there's no point in that. Okay, well, uh, yeah, as I said, it, they put out poison. They put out quite a bit of poison, as you can see. What is it? And I'm going to have Kreia share the load of healing a little bit. All right, now that's dealt with. Their pathing is going to keep making them do that. As am I, apparently. As is my pathing. Ooh, a flex heavy armor. Interesting. Does that mean it's not that heavy? No, unfortunately it is. But it allows for a max dexterity bonus that most heavy armors would not. Interesting. Flex heavy armor allows for greater mobility than even some medium armor. Primary alloy is durasteel, but is treated in methods that are poorly understood by most in the Republic. In fact, it is unclear who manufactures these rare suits of armor. But it's now one of mine. And that's good enough for me. Okay, well, a lot of poison. We're going to be dealing with a lot of poisoning. Good thing Kreia is at least wearing a breath mask, so she's immune. Alright, and there's that. And in we go. And now we get into the fight. 
A lot of melee. A lot of melee. There we go. And we're going to head over. And it looks like the glitch in handling weapons is also uh, dealt with. Um, I should probably explain what I'm talking about. Uh, the glitch was while holding two weapons, they would then sometimes default to holding a dual-bladed style weapon. So instead of holding two separate single weapons, they then defaulted to holding it as if it was a one dual-bladed weapon. It was really weird and a little annoying, but it seems that bug is passed now. So we're good on that. We won't have to worry about that. I'm loving the fact that I'm basically getting them in one hit. When it comes to... Oh, ho, 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 ho. I just noticed how low Baudur's health was. Oh boy. Okay. I'm happy that I'm getting it in one hit in regards to... Uh, stunning. There we go. That's the word I was going with. <laughs> stunning. When it comes to stunning... Oh, geez. She had to make us fast. Oh, boy. All right. So I'm going to have to walk slow just so I'm not constantly making it impossible to see. But, uh, yeah, in my disabled droids, it's actually hitting in one hit instead of having to do multiple times just to hope it doesn't have a save on it. Administrative ID card. Well, that's useful. And a metal case with the Sith War Sword, an Arcanian Energy Shield. Okay. Energy Shield ain't too bad. I have no problem with that. I'm making sure there's nothing I'm leaving behind. There is not, near as I can tell. Good. And the War Sword is actually pretty good. I'm not sure if I would make Ba'udur use it, though. Depends, I guess. Is it upgradable in some way? Uh, upgradable in the edge and grip. It's not that much different than his current longsword. I honestly don't see why not. Oh, once we hit a workbench anyway. Yeah, I don't see why not honestly cannot see why not oh boy that's a lot of poison <laughs> that's a lot of poison procs if i don't go around it okay it's a military doer another salvage pack and more telos droids hooray zen zayshun shah initiate armor zayshun shah that name sounds familiar. I think it's actually a good one. But I don't remember off the top of my head. Damn it. <laughs> Damn it. Damn my inability to remember things well. Alright, well, we'll deal with these ones anyway. Alright, they're actually dealing with him. So, you know what? I'll deal with the other one. And they actually dealt with him faster than I thought. Alright. Alright. And good. They're targeting what I'm targeting. It's actually mildly annoying. I would rather they're not targeting what I'm targeting. I would rather they attack what they commit to attack. But okay, whatever. Droid Energy Collector. Droid Energy Collector. Does that mean what I think it means? Maybe it does. Maybe it does. Now I need to find out. Now I need to find out for sure. Um, droid energy collector. Droid maintenance data pad. Oh, uh, yeah. That thing. Uh, droid maintenance collector. Maintenance collector. Um, come on. Energy collector. There we go. It. Hmm. Huh. It absorbs 80 points. That is a lot. 
initially designed to resist the harsh uh, conditions of factory floors, these shields provide a droid with basic protection against a broad array of effects. Yeah, I can see that. Basically, everything that the defense barrier and the deflector Mark I do not. Well, I think the defense barrier does most, but it does it at a higher capacity. The power drain is significant, however, and they must be replaced regularly. Well, that makes sense. Oh, come on. Every time with the speed. Okay. Um, let me look at the Zation Shah. Baudur can't equip it, unfortunately. Um, does not restrict use of force powers. Defense bonus four, max dexterity plus four, saves fortitude plus one. Station Sha initiates are known for their survival skills and resourcefulness. Their flexible armor is very durable and can be upgraded with some underlays. The outer rim planet of Yanabar was the home of the Zation Sha, who developed their force powers as a means of surviving the harsh planet. Zason Shah stress independence and survival as well as assistance to those in need. Okay. That ain't too bad. Although I think I like the Matukai one more. Honestly. A little bit. Huh. But yeah. Barando. Huh. She can wear the Matukai rope, though. Uh, but she needs the defense more. Okay. Um. Mm. Let's, let's go with Zation Shah. Let's go with the Zation Shah. Because it is actually a higher defense bonus than my current light armor. And if the underlays thing is a... Th thing that's doable, then I don't see why not. I'll just need to swap it out eventually. Uh, but I have the stuff that I need on this one equipped first. Uh, I should just wear this until I get to a workbench. Oh boy. Oh, I can't see. God damn it. <laughs> why did you do this to me? Exchange Shadowcaster. What? Is that a... Is, that feels like a, it's a stealth thing, isn't it? Is it a stealth thing? It would help if I actually hit the buttons I mean to hit. Uh, yes. It adds to stealth, adds to awareness, and adds to dexterity. Interesting. Okay. Hmm. Awareness, stealth, and dexterity. Might be a good thing. Maybe for her. Maybe. I don't know. Perhaps. Uh, uh, maybe it's a better thing for Atten. I'll, I'll consider it. I'll consider it as we go. But for now, now that I can see where I'm going, finally, uh, I came from here. So we go this way. And I make... Yes. Helped if I hit the right button. I make him deal with this. There we go, that's what I wanted. And then now heal, because he is still rather low. There we go. And we go further inside. Two more turrets. Fantastic. That's what I want. Well, that looks like a lab station, but that looks like a workbench. All right, that's what I'm looking for. All right. Uh, a lot of these aren't hitting the way I would hope they would. And these guys aren't attacking at all. That's pissing me off. Okay. Alright, while well, I'm doing this anyway. Okay. Where are they going? Okay, fair enough. You're, you're not... 
You're doing nothing worthwhile when it comes to attacking. It's driving me up a wall. Uh, the fact that she's focusing more on stat bonuses is a detriment. Honestly, it is more of a detriment. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have switched her to Jedi support. <laughs> I'm starting to regret it, honestly. Oh, uh, well, you're not really listening to me as well as I would hope. Okay. Remains, droid defense barrier, okay. There's the lab station, remains off of you. Droid maintenance, machine interface, okay. Hmm. I'm, I'm misreading things and then saying them as the misread things. It's really starting to annoy me, and I'm sure it's annoying the rest of you, so I'm sorry for that. Okay. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Let's go. That's a thing. That's a thing I should make sure of. Is the bug about creating things fixed and breaking down things? Uh, it seems to be with Atten, but it should be, I should be getting more. Should be getting more components out of most of these. And yet I'm just not. That's aggravating. That's more than aggravating. That is infuriating. That shouldn't be a bug. What's wrong with this port <laughs> where that's a bug? Because the computer version has no issue at all like that but the emulated port for xbox one series x does That's aggravating, but there's nothing else I can do about it. Okay, so let's start just breaking down the stuff. Don't need this anymore. Don't need this anymore. I want this. So I can break down that. Break down... Break down that. Good to hold on to that. Um, Zabrak combat suit... It's actually not bad. Okay. So let's actually work on the upgrade. Oh, backing out. Every time. Every time. Okay. Let's pull that off. Pull that off. And there we go. He's in this. Which I guess I can put the heat shielding on. That would be nice but I'm going to switch this there so that way I can get him in that um, I don't have anything equipped on the longsword what I didn't do <sighs> I have it on Kreia's vibro sword but nothing on his are you kidding me <laughs> I am an idiot. Oh, boy. All right. <laughs> All right, whatever. Whatever. I will at least put an edge on this. Not the greatest edge, but it's decent. Uh, actually, what does it even do? Oh, it increases the range of critical threat. That's what it does. Okay. It's not too bad. It's not ideal, but it's not bad. So the vibro blade he was holding, that had stuff on it. Okay. All right. Can't do anything with the grip because I don't have a grip. At least not yet. I could make one. I could make one. Interesting. I could make one. That is interesting. Okay. Um, I 
Yeah, that's good. Uh, this is good for now. Um, okay. So, let me get him wielding, not these, but this. There we go. Uh, the Force Pike. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What skills did I give him again? Or rather, feats would I give him? I didn't give him anything in regards to what weapon type. So I could just make him do dual wielding anyway. Okay, that's good. That's good. I was hoping I didn't give him uh, dueling and just not remember. Okay, good. Good, 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 good. So there we are. That's good enough. And now let's get him to making melee upgrades, which would be good. Ooh, superior Ionite Edge actually wouldn't be bad, but a Quadranium... Quadranium is actually pretty good too. If only I had the components and the security to do it. Costs a lot of components. It costs a lot of components. Jesus. Alright. Um, that adds to slashing damage. Okay, that ain't too bad. Damage penalty... Adds to attack. It's a Brack Grip. Uh, hmm. The superior one at least lowers the defense bonus detriment, but I need a higher repair for that. Basket Hilt adds to defense, but lowers the attack modifier. Mmm, Contoured Grip. I think we can deal with the damage penalty for an attack modifying. I, I would have no problem with that, so let's go with that. Yeah, that's good. Huh. And now let's break down the stuff we don't need. Like, uh, these, really. <laughs> that, uh, these two. Yeah, that ain't too bad. Uh, break down this. I was really hoping we'd get more out of those. I was really hoping we would get more. It's annoying that we don't. Heavy combat suit. I guess I don't need that that badly. Yeah, I can't say that we would. So no, we'll break that down. I guess we'll hold on to this. We'll hold on to this. Don't need this, especially because we have this. Uh... Don't need these as badly. Don't need that that badly. Um, break down these. Don't need that many of them. Break down that. Hmm. Don't need that. I could eventually make better ones of these, so break those down. Definitely don't need this. This just makes things annoying. Um, pinpoint. What does this do? That's keen and a slow. I'll keep those. Those are actually not bad. This adds repair. This adds computer use. Uh, that's actually not bad. Uh, this is terrible compared to this, so we'll get rid of these. Uh, hmm. It just adds a stun. I don't need that when everything else does a decent amount of stun as is. Gamorrean War Axe. That ain't too bad, actually. I don't want to get rid of Atten's Ribbed Jacket, but I don't know why I want to hold on to it. I'm just not sure. Uh, it's not upgradable, so screw it. Uh, don't need that. Yeah, it's a decent amount of, decent amount of components, and it's not really all that useful, so get rid of that. Um, minor uh, uniform. I'm not sure if I want to hold on to this. I feel like no, I don't. So, okay. Now, with that said... Um, 
might as well make some grips for, uh... Yeah. Might as well make some grips for, uh, his stuff. Actually, let me look at armor real quick. He can't make anything regarding strength, can he? No, he cannot. He does not have the treat injury skill. That would be where it's necessary. Stray does, though. Stray Cat does, though. Okay. Well, then I'll do that. <laughs> That's probably for the best. So, bring all the way down to... Oh, I can't do plus three. Really? Oh. I really want to get to that. I really want to get to that, but I can't yet. I need eight more points. I'll get there eventually. Just not yet. Okay. Um, beyond that. Yeah, I can't do anything there. There's no reason to do any of this yet. And there's not much reason to do any of this yet. So, go back <laughs> to this. Oh, this is going to get annoying, and I'm sorry. Um, most of this is required, though. Because I need better things. Okay. Uh, advanced contoured grip. Would it even be worth it for Stray? For any of his stuff to go that way out? Probably would be more worth it to do slashing, if anything else. Do I want to bother using that many... I don't want to use that many components, especially when I will eventually get rid of it for a lightsaber. There, we'll just go with the basic. We'll go with the basic bis basic bitch shit. I don't know why my mouth wanted to try and say both those words at the same time, but there we go. And I guess we'll also make one for uh, Kreia and her stuff. But upgrade. There we go. Give that one of those two. Good. Um, give this the contoured grip, which was what was intended, and then give the granium grip to Kreia's one. And now we just do a shuffle of equipment. <laughs> okay, um, his stuff, his stuff is actually pretty good. Don't want to do much else with it. The Sinigar Warsuit has some good stuff to it. Uh, yeah, it's, it's not worth it to change. It's really not worth it to change yet. So we'll go back to me. Change me to Zayshin Shah Initiate Armor. And then I guess that's it. I guess that's everything. <laughs> everything I really should be doing. Um, maybe I should... Yeah, I should switch to the disruptor rifle. For sure. For sure. Um, okay. And then give him a blaster rifle for that. I was still holding on to a force pike. Why was I doing that? Why was I doing that? I'm a doofus. Okay, uh, all the way down, all the way down. There we go, and enhanced energy cell. I'm sure I can give that to someone. I'm sure there's someone that'll be nice to give to. Maybe not give that to him. Oops, doodle. Uh, what I meant to do was double check everyone else's stuff. Sonic attack penalty. Just do Sonic. Major criticals. 
Uh, I could just do enhanced energy cell, though. Yeah, it's... Uh. Hmm. Nah. Nah, it's fine. I think it's fine. Give her the enhanced energy cell, though. I don't think we need to hold on to everything regarding droids quite yet. Um... Okay. I think our... <laughs> our mini episode of equipment adjustment with Stray Cat and his mind goblins uh, is over. The grunt he made while using that weapon was something <laughs> that I did not expect. But okay, there's the shuttle. There she is, one orbital shuttle. Looks like it's in serviceable condition. That's all the moot point, though. Serviceable not good enough for you? The hangar bay doors are closed. Oh. I don't fancy flying the shuttle through solid metal, so I can say we need to find a way to get them open. We'll also Fair need point. to find the ignition codes for the shuttle, or else we'll have some trouble getting off the ground. If we get mm -hmm. all that, I wouldn't worry about what shape this heap is in. I'll get it running. Fair enough. Well, in that case, I don't know why I'm running around. Let's go ahead and do that. That... There's a big old door that probably won't let me open it. Cannot be opened from here. It may be controlled by a nearby terminal. What the what? This droid has been deactivated. Why has it been deactivated? This old orbital shuttle doesn't have a hyperdrive, but it can get you out of the restoration zone once you have the ignition passcodes and open the underground hangar doors. I didn't want to walk towards it to do that. I just wanted to walk around it. Damn it. Game, let me do what I want. Why can't you let me do what I want? Oh, it's always fucking poison. It's always going to be fucking poison, isn't it? Unlock hangar doors. Oh, they can see them walking around. Base reactor is offline. Then why is everything attacking me? Alrighty, whatever. What? I hear you. What's going on? Fucking ever. Okay. Turn off the security gas vents. Oh, thank you. Whoop. I didn't want to switch weapons. <laughs> I wanted to open the large locker with a frag grenade. What does this one have? A lot more stuff, including another pair. No, not, I shouldn't say pair. Maybe another set of flex heavy armor. That's better. Shadow caster as well. Another sonic discharge cell. That ain't too bad. Uh, infiltrator gloves. Okay. And poison grenades and melee shields. Okay. Okay. That ain't too bad. Now time for another mini episode of Mind Goblin. <laughs> Mind Goblin Equipment Shuffle. <laughs> okay. At least this time I don't need to keep switching to Baudur. Okay. Um, put the Sonic Discharge cell on there just for added massive criticals. Which is always fun. And the attack modifier being brought down is offset by the fact it's balanced, at the very least. Adds also a bonus feat, which is, you know, kind of nice. So yeah, that works. Cool. <laughs> I should be good for a while. All right. Um, hmm. There was another thing I could do, though. Well, I've, I've, since I figured out the repair no longer fucking matters when it comes to breaking down stuff. 
Uh, might as well double check on how much I can get for breaking these down. Four. That ain't too bad. That ain't too bad. I'm not going to do it, but I wanted to know. Um, infiltrator gloves. That ain't too bad, actually. Dexterity plus two. Computer use and security plus four for both. But I don't think I'm going to need it. I have a lot of Mandalorian melee shields. I don't think I need this many. Five should do it. Five should do fine. Now break this down. And I'll hold on to this. For now. Actually, no, I don't need to. I'll break that down. Okay. And I'll break this down because I'm sure I don't need two of them. Okay. Perfect. Now, mind the goblins dealt with. Let us go. Haha. -ha. Oh. Nothing there, but there is something there. Well, hello. Ha ha. Suck it. <laughs> oh, that damage is just beautiful. Salvage pack, a lot of chemicals. Cannot be opened from here. It may be controlled by a nearby terminal. I wonder which terminal. And I can't go that way. So, hello, more droid. At least I'm dealing with you quickly. I have too many melees. I have too many melee people. This is going to become a problem. Like a severe problem. Because they're constantly not doing DPS and instead trying to shuffle around each other to get to a target. It's, it's too much of an issue. It's way too much of an issue. But melee's my strength, and I don't want to get rid of mine. Uh, and I don't want to get rid of Baudor's, because he's good with it, too. Yeah. Sorry, Kra. Eh, that's not what I want. I will, you're going to have to go to blaster only, because we're... Having too much issue otherwise. Well, hi there. At last, someone else. Are you are you part of a rescue team? Uh who are you? I'm part of the first Zerka salvage team. I hit it here when the hit turrets and droids went online. I haven't been able to reach anyone. You you are here to get us out of here, yes? Uh sure, follow me out. I will. Thank you. I'm hoping I can do that without having to get them involved. Good, I can do that. Fantastic. I just need to lead them to the door, I guess. Just end up doubling back, so that's good. Good thing I turned off the vents. Because it would suck otherwise. <laughs> oh, it's so nice not having to deal with the poison. It's so nice. So you had to make a fucking death trap of a zone. You had to. How did I miss this? Well, good thing I doubled back. Did the... Did the motherfucker get lost? Are you kidding me? Are you... Are you fucking kidding me? Are you... Are you for real right now? It's not even that short a trip. How'd you... How'd you fuck up? Are you for real? Are you for real right now? How? Is this as far as you'll go? Are we almost out? 
just keep following me. Is it not... Are you not going to... You're going to... Th I don't understand. I truly don't understand. And now Cray is not... Are, what the hell? What the hell is with the path in? What the fuck is with the pathing in this damn game? Are you for real? Do I need to keep pushing you or something? Come on. Oh my god. Oh my god. What the fuck? Are you for real? Is this based off a mobile port and that's why there's all these bugs? Are you for real right now? Just keep following me. You God's damned idiot. Are you I I cannot believe. I cannot believe this. I swear to fuck, there is no way. There is no way you could have fucked up AI pathing this badly. There's... How? How do you do this? How do you break it so badly? How? Jesus Horatio Christ, it was like pulling teeth to get him this far. Thank you again. I'll wait here for the next freighter. Oh, uh, what? What? I get more light side points and then this happens? Okay, whatever. I guess I'll just sit here and wait. looks ominous. I have felt it too, my lord. A disturbance in the force. It was difficult to make out, my lord. At first, it was such a quiet thing. I did not notice it. But now I wonder if it has always been there. I merely could not hear it before. The sound built so slowly. Yet, when you listen for it, you can make out the strains, even over the background life of the universe. Do you feel it as if... You... You are the darkness in which all life... Dice, my lord. All life exists to feed your power. And my life. My life is yours. I beg you, please. Let me die. Yes, this disturbance. Echoes through the force. I can follow it to its source and bring it to you. I 
will leave at once, my lord. I see. Now I think I understand. I hit a threshold in force points, I guess, where I am now unable to not be noticed through the force. Interesting. It's a bit of bash over your head exposition, but I get the gist of where they're going with it. So I can't open that. That's annoying. But I can get further down here now. Okay. And I take care of you. Maybe not as immediately as I thought. There we go. You're dealt with now. And I make you deal with the force field. As we... Th oh, boy. She had to do that. She had to do that. Well, at least I didn't get stunned. Why are you walking backwards? Why aren't you going towards the threat? What the hell is with the pathing? What, what are you doing? Okay, it's the end of the episode anyway. I don't know what's going on with the path thing today. AI pathing path seems to be broken beyond comprehension, and I don't know why. If it's not one bug, it's another. I just, I don't understand. I cannot understand. It does not make sense. Anyway. I'm done with this episode. Hopefully next episode won't be as buggy. So, thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so you can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one and only Stray Cat. Playing games and trying to fight my way to play this game. Even though the game doesn't seem to want to let me. And, so far, apparently becoming so powerful in the light side that now the dark side of the force has noticed me assuming by that fmv that we saw and we will see what that gets us but considering how powerful we are so far dealing with robots that are in this base anyway we'll see if it means anything that they actually noticed me because I'm sure I can find a way to make this game more broken than it seems to already be. Just, you know, in my favor, rather than trying to make it impossible for me to play. We'll find out. For you!